Today, let's activate Zed Time. You won't want to miss this. Brittany reviews the new game, Killing Floor 2. I'm particularly excited about the face-melting metal soundtrack. Sorry, I mispronounced that. I said it has a FACE-MELTING METAL SOUNDTRACK! Killing Floor 1 is one of the few games that have stuck around forever and still have a super impressive following. So when Killing Floor 2 comes out on the 21st, we can only expect the same greatness. Zesty Mike got beta access a few days ago, and I was lucky enough to hop on his account and kill some zombie scum. If you played Killing Floor 1, you can transfer to Killing Floor 2 pretty seamlessly. However, I did get a little bit distracted and a little mixed up by the intense change in graphics. But it definitely grows in you, and I did eventually adjust. The developer's goals with this one was to change things up immensely. In Killing Floor 1, spawn zones never changed, so it was really easy to learn the system and win. But in Killing Floor 2, the spawn zones are now totally different, so it makes it far more unpredictable. While it's easy to transfer, it's an all new gaming experience. As I said, the graphics have changed to look more modern and higher quality. The devs painted the map with a coat of blood before they applied the final textures. This way, any Zed you kill, their blood never leaves the map between waves. Bodies also stay piled up for quite some time too. It gets gruesome. The Zeds have been customized to be more expressive and have individual attacks so fighting them off doesn't get repetitive. The scariest update for me is the Scrake and Flesh Pound Roar. Because they aren't already terrifying enough, they now have a frighteningly loud roar to announce when they're here. What is that? Another really cool map feature is that when you break lights, they stupid car. Another really cool map feature is that when you break lights, they stay broken. And this is a huge issue because now when sirens scream, they break lights. And each time they scream, the darker it gets. Causing you to have to play with flashlights for the rest of the game or relocate completely. In addition to lights blowing out, walls break, doors blow off the hinges, and doors don't regen if they're busted down. Which means if you're trying to hold an area, it's gonna degenerate to the point where you're gonna be in serious trouble. Characters have also been completely changed as well. They look so awesome! Characters are customizable in that you can change their hair, their gear, and their colors. And spec levels have been raised to 25, up from 6. A melee button has also been included. The trader that we all know and love has been replaced by a highly advanced 3D printer pod. Last but not least, there's a new boss to fight on the last level. Hans Volter, a speedy poisonous terror. He can rush players and grab them, sucking the life out of anyone in his clutches. He'll also ward off packs of players by throwing down grenades that create toxic clouds. I'm not going to spoil everything for you. You'll have to play it for yourself when it comes out on the 21st to see just how awesome it is. Thank you guys for joining me this week while we talk about the awesome Killing Floor 2. If you have any other suggestions that you'd like to see me talk about, leave a comment down below letting me know what it is. If you want to see more of my gameplay coverage, you can check me out on my channel, Brits Games. The link is in the description below. And until next time, I hope that you guys enjoyed this. If you did, leave a thumbs up and a comment down below, and I will see you next week. Goodbye! Hey guys, my name is Britt, and today we are playing Killing Floor 2! Ah! This is just the beta, and I'm playing with my friend Joe and his team. Joe is like the most amazing killing floor person ever. All right, we are on wave two, because the first wave was just me not knowing what is happening. And Impulse is produced by the Freedom Network. Ever wanted to earn revenue from your videos? Freedom offers a great partnership program which includes access to hundreds of thousands of audio tracks, sponsorships with great partners, and most importantly, a no-lock-in contract. You can leave at any time, for any reason. We accept everyone, both big and small. For more information, click here or visit the link in the video description.